and the derivative of the following problem. So uh, this is going to be a product rule pretty much. So what's going to happen here, oops, let me get some, is uh, we'll take d dx of negative 4x squared, even though negative 4 is a constant, cosine of x, plus negative 4x squared times d dx of our cosine of x. So what will happen here now is the derivative of negative 4x squared is going to be negative 8x cosine x. And then we'll have our minus 4x squared, and the derivative of cosine is negative sine of x. So we end up with negative 8x cosine x, negative 4x squared and negative sine of x. That makes plus 4x squared sine of x. And it doesn't matter in particular which, however you order these, you can flip-flop them if you like. But anyway, that's the derivative. All right, I hope this helped you out. Appreciate you taking time to watch, and you have yourself a great day.